James, you've just won the Community Shield in Man City, but on a personal level, your focus now shifts to England uh, as a big game against Italy on Wednesday ahead of the World Cup qualifiers. Yeah, it's always important to, to, to um, you know get the time together with the with the England squad. Um, it's, it's not easy; you don't get um, a lot of time together. So when you get these trips, it's important to get the game time. And obviously, with the, the manager coming in, and um, we've had a major tournament under him, which was which was great as well. Um, but the more time we have together, the better we can get to know how he wants to play and, and improve as a team. It's fantastic to you know get the call, and you know I feel ready, and you know I just looking forward to going out there and getting that experience under my belt. There's a few players in the squad that you would be aware of, um, both with Chelsea and the England youth teams. Uh, will that help you settle, do you think? Yeah, definitely. I think if you look at the team, it's quite a young team, so I hope you'll be able to bond really well and you know, it'll be a good experience. And the last time England met Italy, obviously, it didn't go the way you, you would have liked, but is this a chance to maybe exercise some demons from that game? I think so. You obviously want to get straight back on on the bandwagon and, and try to get a result against a team who's, um, you know, effectively they didn't win the game, you know, we obviously drew and, and went out on penalties, which was disappointing, but um, the, again, there was lessons to be learned from the tournament, but plenty of positives as well, and I think it's a changed squad as well with a lot, uh, a lot of players coming in, so it'll be, it'll be good to um, uh, see the competition for places and people obviously want to get in and, and stay in the squad. And do you think that um, the fact that there are six new or six uncapped players in the squad, will that bring out a sense of freshness to the squad? Yeah, I think um, since I've been in the squad definitely as well, there's been a, a big change and there's more and more players than maybe I played youth uh, international football with and you know, we've got seem to have a very good mix now. There's still the you know, um, got some very good experienced players as well. The manager's left quite a few, you know, experience especially in the back four out this time, but you know, Lamps is there and um, He's at least one experienced player, so um, I think it's a good mix. We still have that, and like I said, there's competition of places, and you want to see the younger players coming through and, and see what they can do to stake a claim as well. Coming into the side for the for the first time, you know, we obviously want to go in there and you know give a good account of ourselves and hopefully be you know recalled in future games. And it's been quite a quite a whirlwind summer for you. You've just uh, finished a, a stint at the Olympics. How did you find that whole experience? Yeah, it's fantastic. You know, the Olympics is brilliant to be a part of it and you know to learn from you know some some great you know senior players that we had in the team and you know it's a fantastic experience to be involved in seeing the athletes you know on a you know sort of daily basis when we was at the Olympic Village and see their preparation and stuff and you know you can really learn a good few things.